Hello and welcome to Hibus TV. Kerala-based technology-driven startup Intot, which aims to provide a cost-effective and high-quality digital media broadcast receiver solutions across the globe, has raised an undisclosed amount from the bridge or the second round of investments from Unicorn India Ventures. Unicorn India had first seeded the company in 2018. Intot focuses on providing high-quality and cost-effective IP solutions for next-generation digital media broadcast receivers, namely Digital Radio Mondial, DAB, DAB+, CDR, ISDB-T and HD Radio receivers in collaboration with Xperi. The company plans to use the funds to procure highly sophisticated and precision digital radio test equipment that is required for RF and timing performance testing for all the digital radio broadcast receiver standards. Intot was incorporated in 2014 by Prashant Tankappan, the company's CTO, and Rajat Nair, co-founder and CEO. The company's SDR receiver solutions cover a wide range of digital radio broadcast standards and geographies such as DRM in India, Russia, South Africa and Indonesia, DAB, DAB Plus in Europe, Australia and the Middle East, HD Radio in USA, Canada and Mexico, and CDR in China. Mr. Nair said their objective is to enable Intot to provide high-quality and cost-effective digital radio broadcast receiver solutions across all geographies, and it can be inside cars, houses, and smartphones. The continued support from Unicorn India is a testament to the success they have achieved so far and the growth plans that are chalked out for the next two years. The current digital radio broadcast receiver solutions in market require dedicated chips that are high in cost and are used to perform complex operations like demodulation in hardware, thus making the end solution very costly. Such high costs prevent swift penetration into emerging and high volume markets like India, the European Union, South Africa, Russia, China and Indonesia where the usage of DRM, DAB and CDR technologies is mandated by governments and broadcasters. The USP of Intot is that its SDR implementation along with patented improvisations runs on ARM processors making it high quality and cost effective for original equipment manufacturers and bringing down the receiver cost within the reach of the common man. Intot has licensed its digital radio receiver solutions to multiple tier 1 customers including Clarion and Telechips. Anil Joshi, managing partner Unicorn India Ventures said they entered Intot two years back and since then have seen the company's growth and its ability to create IP which will work in global markets like the US, Europe and China. They have extended this additional funding so that they can develop more IPs and scale up faster. It is the only company in India which can serve multiple bandwidths across different markets. Inter Technologies is a technology driven company with prime focus on enabling cost effective and high quality next generation digital media receivers. It is all set to play a pivotal role in the analog sunset of AM and FM broadcast radio transmission, paving way to digital radio transmission in the near future. Intert is a winner of several prestigious awards including Asocham 4th ICT Startup Awards 2020, Digital Radio Mondial Enterprise Award 2019 and CII Industrial Innovation Awards for the Best Service Startup 2017. It is a member of Digital Radio Mondial Consortium, World DAB and has collaboration with Xperi for HD Radio Receiver Solutions. Unicorn India Ventures is a Mumbai-based venture capital that started in 2015 by Anil Joshi and Bhaskar Majumdar. The fund has also launched a UK-India cross-border fund for funding UK startups looking to enter India and has invested in seven UK startups. From its first fund, Unicorn India Ventures has invested in 18 companies like Inc. 42, Pharmarac, Genrobotics, Neuroequilibrium, Smartcoin, OpenBank and OpenApp to name a few. Unicorn India has also announced Fund 2, which is a Rs 400 crore fund launched in 2019. It has also marked its first close of Rs 90 crore and has announced 6 investments.